Have you ever wondered just how vast the universe truly is? Think about it. The universe, an infinite expanse of stars, planets, galaxies, and everything in between, is an entity that our human minds struggle to comprehend. Its sheer size is mind-boggling. And the most awe-inspiring part, it's continuously expanding. Yes, you heard it right. The universe isn't static. It's growing, stretching out into the unknown, reaching farther than we can ever imagine. In the grand cosmic ballet, galaxies pirouette away from each other, creating a dance of celestial bodies that's nothing short of magical. Doesn't it make you feel small? But don't worry, feeling small isn't always a bad thing. It's a reminder that we are part of something much larger, a cosmic tapestry full of wonder and mystery. Today, we will visualize this unimaginable size through a thrilling 3D journey. Get ready for a cosmic adventure like no other. We start our journey right here at home, on our very own planet Earth. A stunning sphere of blues and greens, Earth is the fifth largest planet in our solar system. It measures about 7,917 miles in diameter, a size that might seem colossal when you're standing on its surface. Yet, when we take a step back and compare it to the grandeur of the cosmos, our Earth appears astonishingly small. To put it into perspective, think about this. You could fit 1,300,000 Earths into the Sun, and our Sun is just an average-sized star in a galaxy that's home to billions of other stars. So, in the grand cosmic dance, our beloved planet is but a diminutive dancer, twirling gracefully in the vast expanse of space. But as we will see, Earth is just a tiny speck in the grand scheme of the universe. Next, we venture out into our solar system, where Earth is just one of the eight planets. First, we have Mercury, the smallest of them all, roughly one-third the size of Earth. It's so small you could fit over 18 Mercuries inside our home planet. Next up is Mars, slightly larger than Mercury but still just over half the size of Earth. Don't let its size fool you though, this red planet has the tallest volcano and the deepest, longest canyon in the solar system. Now, let's move on to Venus. This beauty is almost identical to Earth in size, earning it the nickname, Earth's Twin. But don't be deceived by appearances. Venus is the hottest planet in our solar system with surface temperatures enough to melt lead. Next in line is Neptune, four times the size of Earth. It's the farthest planet from the Sun and its beautiful blue color is due to the methane in its atmosphere. Similar in size to Neptune is Uranus, the only planet to spin on its side. Uranus is also four times the size of Earth. Its pale blue color is a result of the ammonia and water in its atmosphere. Our next stop is Saturn, known for its iconic rings. Saturn is nine times the size of Earth. Despite its size, it's the lightest planet and would float in water if there was a bathtub big enough. Next up is Jupiter, the largest planet in our solar system. It's a staggering 11 times the size of Earth. Its great red spot, a storm that's raged for at least 300 years, is so large that Earth could fit inside it three times over. Lastly, we have the gas giant, Jupiter's near twin, Saturn. It's just slightly smaller than Jupiter, but still a colossal nine times the size of Earth. As we can see, even within our own solar system, Earth is dwarfed by the sheer size of the other planets. But what lies beyond the boundary of our solar system? Well, once we venture past the furthest reaches of our solar system, we find ourselves in the vast expanse of the Milky Way galaxy. Our solar system is just one small part of this immense cosmic city, which is home to an estimated 200 billion to 400 billion stars. That's right, billions with a B. The Milky Way galaxy is a spiraling disk, with a diameter that stretches a mind-boggling 100,000 light-years across. To put that into perspective, if we somehow managed to travel at the speed of light, it would take us 100,000 years to cross from one side of the galaxy to the other. And remember, that's just one galaxy among countless others in the universe. Our solar system, on the other hand, is just a tiny dot in this expanse. Even if we were to line up all the planets in our solar system end to end, they would barely make a ripple in the scale of the Milky Way. This comparison is not meant to belittle our home, but to emphasize the grandeur of the cosmos. The vastness of the Milky Way is a humbling reminder of our place in the universe. Just imagine, our entire solar system with all its planets, moons, asteroids, and comets is only a minute part of one arm of the spiraling Milky Way galaxy. It's a cosmic dance on a grand scale, with our solar system performing its own ballet, revolving around the galactic center every 250 million years. As we continue to explore the universe, we are constantly reminded of how much there is to discover. Each star in our galaxy could host a solar system of its own, 
each with its unique planets, moons, and potentially life. It's awe-inspiring to think about our place in the universe. This is our cosmic neighborhood, vast, beautiful, and ever-expanding. It's a humbling reminder that we are just tiny specks in the grand scheme of things, yet we are capable of understanding and appreciating the universe in all its grandeur. Our solar system is but a minute part of the massive Milky Way galaxy. Don't forget to keep exploring the wonders of our universe with us. To ensure you don't miss on our future cosmic journeys, subscribe to our YouTube channel, History TV. Now let's delve into the universe, a vast sea of galaxies. Imagine standing at the edge of a colossal ocean, where the horizon stretches out into infinity. That's the closest comparison we can make when we try to visualize the universe. But instead of water, this ocean is filled with galaxies, each one teeming with stars, planets, and an untold number of mysteries. The universe as we understand it is approximately 93 billion light years in diameter. For some perspective, one light year is about 6 trillion miles. Now multiply that by 93 billion. The numbers are staggering, aren't they? But what's even more mind-boggling is the sheer number of galaxies filling this vast space. Estimates vary, but it's believed there are around 200 billion galaxies, each one a unique collection of stars, planets, and other celestial objects. Now let's bring this back home to our own galaxy, the Milky Way. It's a barred spiral galaxy, about 100,000 light years across. When we compare that to the size of the universe, it's like comparing a grain of sand to the size of the Earth. Yet within the Milky Way, we have over 200 billion stars, each possibly hosting its own system of planets. Our home, the Earth, is just one of these planets orbiting one of these stars. It's a humbling thought, isn't it? Even as we continue to explore and understand our own galaxy, we must remember that it's merely one small part of a much larger cosmic tapestry. Each galaxy is a piece of the puzzle, a story waiting to be told, a mystery waiting to be unraveled. So next time you look up at the night sky, remember that each pinprick of light could be a galaxy, a whole new world of possibilities. The universe is indeed a vast sea of galaxies, and we are but tiny voyagers on its boundless expanse. Our Milky Way galaxy, as large as it is, is merely one of billions in the infinite universe. So, how do all these cosmic entities measure up? Let's start with what we know best, our galactic home, the Milky Way. The Milky Way is a barred spiral galaxy that spans more than a hundred thousand light years across. Now, let's compare our home to other inhabitants of the universe. Consider our nearby neighbor, the Andromeda Galaxy, which boasts a diameter of approximately 220,000 light years, easily outstripping our own in size. Triangulum, another member of our local group, though smaller than the Milky Way, still stretches across an impressive 60,000 light years. As we venture further, we come across the enormous IC 1101, which is considered one of the largest known galaxies, with its astronomical diameter of approximately 6 million light years. But that's not the end. On the opposite end of the spectrum, we have Segway 2, a petite galaxy spanning a mere thousand light years across. To help visualize these staggering figures, imagine shrinking the entire universe so that the Milky Way is the size of a coin. In this scale, Andromeda would be the size of a small plate, I see 1101, a large beach ball, and Segway 2 would be a mere speck of dust. These comparisons give us an inkling of the overwhelming scale of the universe. They serve as a humbling reminder that our Milky Way galaxy, despite being vast from our perspective, is but a small piece of the cosmic jigsaw. As we can see, the universe presents a staggering range of scales, and we inhabit only a minuscule portion of it.